I teach a required course for undergraduates. Um, it's called International Finance. To understand the role of currencies and how that impacts firms' profitability and how it affects firms' decisions is very important for any finance major. And therefore, I think uh, this course is very, very helpful in informing the students about what role do the currencies play uh, for uh, firms and also understanding how large the currency markets are. The daily trading volume in the currency markets is on the scale of $5 trillion per day. And if you compare that with all equity markets across the globe, not just the New York Stock Exchange, across the globe, we're talking about something like $60 trillion in a year on equities. So currency markets are the largest markets, the most liquid, and therefore uh, for a finance major to understand these markets is very important. This course sort of takes them through uh, the, the raising capital in foreign currency markets, understanding how you value a project in an emerging market. So if you're Nike and you want to build a, a manufacturing facility in Viet Vietnam, how do you value that? Uh, this course would teach you those kinds of things. One thing that makes the international finance course very interesting is uh, the emphasis on case studies. I do about eight case studies throughout the semester, and th these run from uh, understanding the role of currency swaps in uh, hedging currency risk or uh, valuation of an international bond or uh, valuation of a project that is uh, uh, based abroad. So there's a particular case that I do where a power plant uh, based in the US is trying to build a power plant in Pakistan. And to understand the valuation of that power plant in Pakistan is uh, a part of this course. So those kinds of case studies, I think, make the course very engaging because you look at the practical implications of the principles that you learn in the course.